All right, guys, we're back. Welcome back to Let's Play Rune Factory 2, a fantasy harvest moon. Uh, we did a crap ton in the last two episodes, which was supposed to be one episode until I realized how long it was really going on for. And now here we are. I added probably... I'll do it now, actually. This is me catching my first flounder. And I also caught two more. I think I actually caught a third. I think there is one in my uh, thing, or maybe even a fourth. However many. This one will be shipped. And I also will ship this one. And also I didn't read the description, so I should probably do that. I'll keep this one though. Both eyes are on the left side of this fish's body. Larger mouth and sharper teeth than the turbo. Turbots, tur 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 whatever it is. I will also be shipping the sweetie potato, butter and milk mixed into yam strainings, then poured into molds and baked. I wasn't sure if I was going to need it, I could keep it, but I'm out of inventory space and I really just want to have it. Uh, actually, you know what? We're up to 21% achieved thus far, having made 703,000 just via the shipping stuff, 530,000 of which has been crops. Freaking. Heck yeah. We've actually shipped 39% of the fish, and I've not been going for fish, really. So that's awesome. Okay. The Gorilla. A winter saltwater fish. A popular, easy-to-hook catch. Puts up a bit of fight when reeling in. We're shipping one of these. I've caught in quite a few, but I just keep tossing them back. And we're shipping another flounder, just because I checked, and sure enough, I do have enough. It should be noted that I did clear my inventory by selling the uh, oversized hammer that I had. Actually, I'm already here. Alright, today is a birthday, so we are purchasing the curry rice for eighteen or for 3600 A mealtime staple, so much that there isn't a soul, adult, or child who has not tasted it. I... Uh, you know, have tried it more recently, but when I was a child, definitely not. <laughs> oh, it's raining today. Well, uh, the emery flowers are almost done. The, I believe these are blue crystals are almost done. And these ones are done! These are not quite done, though. So these ones did finish yesterday, and these ones aren't quite there yet. So once these finish, we'll be done here in Machina, period. No, nope, neither of these ones yet. Birthday, 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 birthday! This curry rice is my favorite present, isn't it? Thank you! Morning. Good morning, Kyle. Hope you're eating well today. Listen to this, Kyle. I've come down with the pear allergy for one whole week. Natalie told me. If you eat a pear, you could die. Could you believe it? I can imagine going one whole week without even a single pear. I don't think pears exist. I think you're a liar. Yeah, we're actually done for today. I don't have anything else, so, uh, onward to the next festival. Huh. I was just fishing. It's, uh, still the 10th. I was, I was just getting some fishing and trying to level up and whatnot. See if I might be able to do exactly this. I got a yellowtail. I... I got a yellowtail. That's... That's amazing. Because I've been fishing for, like, three days straight. I've not got a yellowtail. <laughs> uh, I need more of these. I'm gonna need three of these, I think. But that's a good start. Now that I'm level 40, I caught my first one. Alright guys, now welcome to the 19th. Also known as the Mining Contest. So, let's start talking. Today's the day of the Mining Contest. I want each participant to do their best, but to also be aware of the dangers in the caves. I need to make sure to tell them all if things get dangerous, they should turn back right away. The mining contest today. Are you going to enter, Kyle? Today is the mining contest. According to my fortune, you're going to do well, Kyle. Better do well to prove it right. Today is the mining contest. I bet you're pretty good with the hammer, Kyle. Oh, bunk. Today is the mining contest. You'll have to go into the caves to mine. I'm safe as long as I have my sword, but it might be dangerous for you. If you let your guard down, it could be dangerous for you too, Jake. Human, I don't need you to tell me that. It's the mining contest today. Are you crazy? I'm not going to have anything to do with some stupid mining contest. So, Bear just does not seem to be a fan of any kind of dangerous activity. It's not about being manly or anything. It's all just 
why would you put yourself in danger? Oh, right. Will you be participating in the mining contest, Kyle? Today is the mining contest. You like this kind of thing, don't you, Kyle? I'm no good at it, though. Hmm. Interesting. It's the mining contest today. I wonder if I could slice a rock open with my sharpest sword. Hmm. Oh, the mining contest is today. I thought I might enter too, but you look like you're really good at it. Maybe I'll take a turn sitting out this time. Today's the mining contest. How about it? You try your hand at it, Kyle. You might go dig up something real nice. I'm no good with a hammer. I'm not really used to just swinging one. Liar! Oh, it'd be totally impossible for me. Still, if you dig up some jewels, think of me. Oh, today's the mining contest. If you get to go into caves, right? I want to go too! You won't be safe all alone, Kyle. Today's the mining contest. Are you going to participate, Kyle? They're done! I never have to come back to Machina Valley again. Bye-bye, world! Today's there's a mining contest. There's a mining contest today. Don't hit your own foot with the hammer. Today's the mining contest. When men square off with each other armed with nothing but a hammer. Today's the mining contest. Miner minerals have wondrous properties. If you wear one, it can lend you its strength. I guess it might just be able to mine, though! Bwahaha! <laughs> Today's the mining contest. If you're going to enter the contest, be careful in there. I'm used to going inside the dungeon by now. I'll be fine. A little confidence is good, but don't let your guard down. Today's the mining contest! I know the shortcut out into the caves no one else even the bit. I know the shortcut into the caves nobody else knows about. You won't get it out of me, Kyle. He would be pretty good with that kind of thing. So we're here. So in this case, we're going to have a little bit of a... Th it's not picking up the auto correctly. So I just realized that it hasn't been working this entire time. The audio hasn't. It's fixed now. It should be good. It was working before I started recording. Then I had an issue. Then I had to reset and it broke. So we should be good now though. Now like I was saying, uh, today we're going to be mining. Or kind of. Morning. Good morning, Kyle. I hope you're eating well today. Oh, Kyle, are you participating in the mining contest? It's a chance to show off the fruits of your hard work. And if you win, that special someone's opinion of you no doubt go up. What's more, the winner will receive a fabulous prize. So how about it? Oh, it's also pretty obvious, but if you don't have a hammer, you won't be able to compete. Kyle! Whoa. You totally made me jump. All of a sudden, I heard this booming voice behind me. I scared you. Oh, sorry. Are you participating in the mining contest too, Kyle? Isn't that ambitious? Well, I'm not exactly... It's, I'm, I'm not exactly I'm competing because I'm ambitious, per se. It's not like I'm actually competing because I'm ambitious, I think is what they're trying to say. Well, wow, Roy, you really know some tough words there, don't you? Yep, I learned them from my mom. Are you... Are you participating too, Roy? Yep. Wow, you're going to be a pretty tough opponent. If we get full of ourselves for even a second, Roy's going to sweep the rug right out from under our feet. Seriously, we've got to give this our all. Nande yet nen. Did this just not get translated? Hey, you're all using the same phrase. You're already using the same phrase I taught you. But you're kind of using it at the wrong time. Just a second. If I'm looking at the right thing. It means what are you talking about, and it has to do with a culture, like a regional dialect, and it was used in slapstick, I guess? I don't know. Oh, shucks, you're right. Hey, you, can you teach me some funny things to say later? Of course. But right now, it's about the contest. Nanda Yanen! Let's do it. That's what I'm talking about, Kyle! And now for the rules! The mining contest tests how quickly you can get into a dungeon and mine a specific stone or gem. Today's object will be... Ba -da -ba -ba -bum, ruby! It doesn't matter which dungeon you mine in, so feel free to go anywhere you want. Alright, so future game. Right now is going to give you a full table of each gem. This, like, it'll give you the gem and then where it can be found. At this point, you should know this. It's You're at the end of the first year. I'll be measuring the time it takes you to mine out a ruby and bring it to me. 
The person with the shortest time will be the winner. Or wiener, one of the two. Do you want to hear the rules one more time? No, let's go. Is everyone ready? On your marks, get set, go! Yeah. You don't have to mine anything. Ruby, a crimson jewel, the most valuable ones create a star of refractive light inside, represents passion. Oh, what an unbelievably fast time! To think I'd live to see unprecedented speed! You just pulled that out of your pocket! Time powers are a miracle! Yes, it was the time powers, it wasn't me cheating. The glory of victory goes to Kyle! Congratulations! Kyle, allow me to grant you the title of Mining King! Furthermore, I present you with this Invincibroid as a reward for your efforts. Invincibroid. The winner of the competition is Kyle. Honor mention goes to Roy, and the Constellation Prize goes to Yue. Congratulations, Kyle. Congratulations! Yue, since we're celebrating, would you teach us another one fun forward phrase? I don't see what it has to do with celebrating or anything, but... Uh, oh, Alright, I'll teach you. Yay! This time, I'll teach you... Let's see. Mido. Mido! It's a way for a merchant to say goodbye to a customer who's just made a purchase. Really? Got it! Alright then. Let's try it out. Find your mother and ask for a piece of candy. When she gives it to you, say, Mido, alright? Alright, I'll get a piece of candy from Mom and say, Mido! Wait, why would I do that? <laughs> What's wrong? You're funny, you two. Wanna make a snowman together? Let's see who can make the biggest. That is incredible, Kyle. You didn't even use my shortcut. Kyle, you really did it, didn't you? Did you find any rare minerals? If you did, I might be able to sell it for a lot of money. I have a lot of rare stuff. The Dyson Kokio Park was built entirely through investment by the Dyson Kokio family. So, what do you think? This is a place of new friendships. We hope you like it. Congratulations, Kyle, I'm going to grant you the title of Mining King. Invinceroid, medicine that heightens all abilities. One swig turns you into a superhero. I'm not... I'm going to look at this real quick. I decided to look into this a little bit. Uh, I believe this is the one that heals you for like 500 HP and like a full bar of RP and also removes all status effects. So it's like a full heal kind of thing. I don't think that's necessary, per se, but that's really nice. Just as I predicted. You won. Congratulations. Wow, I didn't think you would go so well. You would do so well, Kyle. I never thought you'd be able to. Well done, Kyle. I thought you'd do it. Not bad. Congratulations on winning. You're a lot stronger than you look, Kyle. I knew you'd win, Kyle. I just knew it. Wow, well, well done. Hey, you'd better not tell me you're switching to a hammer now, okay? I actually do use the hammer quite a bit. I have stopped more recently. Morning. Congratulations, you won! It really makes a difference when you've got such polished skills. You did it, Kyle. Let's see what you brought back. Kyle, you really did it! You're just the man I thought you'd be! That turned out really well for you, didn't it, Kyle? I was really surprised. Hey, you won the contest. You're really something. Not bad, not bad. Next time I'll have to personally show you how it's done. Did you find anything interesting? It looks like you did well! When I need any minerals, I'll be sure to ask for your help, Kyle! You already have many times, remember? <laughs> and that is everything for today. I have done it all. Everyone loves me a little bit more. Because of that... Egan is at 6, Tanya, Roy, Byron, and Herman are at 7, Natalie, Ray, Douglas, Barrett, Jake are all at 8, Cammie, Gordon, and Max are at 9, and everyone else is at 10. All the girls are at 10, at least. So we're done for today. I shall see you, I believe, on the 25th is the next day? I believe that's the next birthday? I'm not 100% positive, so see you then! Bye! Okay. The ruby ring for 6320 has a mysterious appealing design. Look deep inside the ruby and you'll get lost in its passion. Uh, oh, I'm actually full currently. 
Uh, we're gonna sell the water crystals. And buy the ruby ring. Get on the sofa's back! And while I'm thinking about it, ship Birthday! Cheers. Is this a birthday present for me? Great, thanks! Morning. Good morning, Kyle. You can shop today. Do you know about the Force Beginnings? Apparently it's filled with monsters. If you ever go there, be sure you have one of our weapons. Hmm, welcome! For some other reason, I see a hammer in your hands rather than a sword. How... How can you tell? How can you tell? Considering my weapon skill is about to be 39 and my mining skill is 89. Oops. Alright, and that's it for Tanya's birthday. So, on to the 25th for the next birthday. Bye-bye! It's an earthquake! That was a big one, whew. Well, it looks like it's over. I hope everyone's okay. Well, I was gonna meet you the 25th. Uh, I guess I'll run around and talk to everyone because I like their dialogue. Morning. Good morning, Kyle. You're looking very sharp today. You feel that earthquake? Call the weapons around and around again. It's scary, I tell ya. Another earthquake? I wonder what's behind all these quakes. Kyle, you should investigate it. My intuition is always right, human. Fair. Th yeah, okay. Uh, the earthquake ruined my life. What happened? Are you okay? Are you hurt or anything? I'm fine, but I spilled my tea in the stainless outfit that I really like. Huh? Ah, uh, please don't make it sound so serious next time. I was worried that you'd been seriously injured or something. Well, it was a serious injury to me. Uh, I really liked it so much. You really don't understand girls, do you, Kyle? There was another earthquake this morning, wasn't there? It's starting to get more and more s- I'm starting to get more and more scared. Like something big is gonna happen. Well, another earthquake. I'm starting to get a little worried. What do you think's going on? I didn't see this earthquake coming either. It's enough to make me lose confidence. Dorothy, there was another earthquake. Are you okay? Oh, I'm... I'm fine. Fern rescued me. Fern? Well, at any rate, you're not hurt. We had another earthquake. I wonder if something is going on. Another earthquake again. If they keep happening this often, I might have to set up an emergency plan. Here goes another earthquake. What do you think is behind them? From a statistical standpoint, the amount of earthquakes that we've been experiencing lately is quite bizarre. We've had earthquakes after uh, we've had earthquake after earthquake. I can't help but be worried. Why well, I was so frightened last night I was only able to finish three of my stakes. <laughs> there was another earthquake. Actually, I've kept a record of the earthquake occurrences and their strength as far back as we've been having them, but according to my notes, the recent series of tremors there doesn't seem the result of any volcanic activity or tectonic plate strain. Which leads me to believe that this earthquake must have been caused by something unnatural. What could possibly have been that what could possibly have that kind of power? The Empire would be capable of doing something like that. But no, there's no advantage to do so doing something like that. Hmm. Another earthquake, and we went went so many years without one. Another earthquake? Is everybody okay? Don't worry about me, please just hurry and check on everyone else! Wow, there's another earthquake! There are so many of them, they really freaked my sister out! Do you get scared too, Kyle? I want to see that happen. I guess Roy was back in his house and I missed him again. Weird. Weird. Mm, more earthquakes! I'm glad everyone is okay, but there have been so many of them recently, I'm quite worried! We had another earthquake. This is starting to get annoying. Sure enough, he was right here. Morning. Good morning! Good morning, Kyle! There, have been sh there sure have been a lot of earthquakes recently. Mom's screaming is the worst part, though. Rude! Another earthquake. I think I'm gonna have to close up shop for the day. All my merchandise got scattered around again. That's terrible, but I'm just glad that you didn't get hurt, you, eh? Well, I was thinking I had to close my store for the day, but since you're here, maybe I can keep it open just a little longer. Wow, even now you're still thinking about your business. 
And that is everybody for today. So I'll meet you all on the 25th for the next birthday. Bye bye. Alright. So today, we're gonna wanna buy some french fries. Peeled and sliced potatoes fried in oil. So crispy, salty, and addicting. For a nice little 1740G. Ah, uh, wow. I believe that means we've bought every other item from her. Yeah, that's every single other item. Yue, we have coined you out of stock, thank you. We of course could buy more, but why would we? Roy, you're supposed to be my boy. You in here and I just missed you in the back? He's not here. I have no idea where he is. Maybe he's on his way here, or something. I'll look around. Alicia, why do you not work on holidays? Maybe he's at home, because it's his birthday. Possibly. There you are! Good morning, Kyle. Good to see you. How do you better start thinking about marriage, Kyle? Huh? Where did that come from, Roy? That's just what my mom said. I don't know anything about stuff like that. Okay, so rather than wait for him to walk all the way there, we're going to try this. Thanks! <laughs> A birthday present! Wow, thanks! Anything interesting happening? Nothing, actually. Your birthday, but... You don't talk about that. We don't talk about Roy's birthday. No, no, no. Egan's at six. Byron, Herman are at seven. Douglas, Jake, Tanya, and Roy, Natalie, Barrett, <laughs> Ray are all at eight. Cammie, Gordon, and Max are at nine, and then all the girls are at ten. We're close, but we're not gonna get up to ten, I don't think. And that's fine. Unless something changes. Guys, that is the end of this birthday. I will meet you back for the final holiday of the year on the 31st. Kind of. We'll get into that in a minute. See you right then. Alright guys, welcome to the 30th. Also known as New Year's Eve. So, I'm going to take care of my field real quick, then we're going to go talk to people. There's no real event today, but it's just cool dialogue. Today's the last day of the year, and here's to the next one. Don't forget to get your fortune told. Today marks the end of another year. Let's make next year a great year too, Kyle. Today's the last day of the year. Here's to the next one, eh? Today's the New Year's Eve. It's been quite the year. Try not to cause too much trouble next year. The last day of the year. The end of another year. What an unremarkable year this was. Well, uh, there was all the stuff, you know, the earthquakes, and the fact that I came here? No? Oh, okay. It's the last day of the year. I've had a very interesting year. Next year, all I want is good health and good business. That sounds like something you'd say, UA. Me, I just hope I can get plenty of work done in my field. Let's hope we both have another good year. There are only a couple of hours left in the year. Best wishes for the coming year, Kyle. Today's the last day of the year. Let's you and me work together to make the next one even better, Kyle. The end of another year, with a new one starting from tomorrow. Time for a fresh perspective on everything. Keep on working to improve the town next year too, Kyle. Good morning, Kyle. If you want to be like me, make sure to eat five meals a day. The year's almost over. Let's enjoy the next year to the fullest. It's New Year's Eve, time to think back over another year spent and consider how to kick off the next one. Another year of great swords to ahead. A ahead, ahead. I dead. Morning. Good morning, Kyle. You look strong and healthy as usual. Good luck next year, Kyle. Today's New Year's Eve. A lot has happened this year, didn't it? I hope next year's nice too. Same here, Julia. I'm working hard to make sure next year turns out great too. Let's work at it together, Kyle. Today's New Year's Eve. Next year I want to go explore places I've never been. Today's New Year's Eve. We sure had a lot of fun this year. Here's to a good year next year. That's right. Here's to more... more than that. Here's to more fun, Cammy. Good morning. The year... The year ends today. May next year be filled with happiness as well, Kyle. Well, that's it for this year. Have another year of good health, Kyle. 
Well, today's the end of another year. We gotta toughen you up even more next year, kid. It's the last day of the year! Lord, thank you for giving us another peaceful year in your divine mercy! What are you doing, Cobb? You need to pray too! And that's it. That's the entire event. People just say Happy New Year and, you know, reminisce a little bit. So, with that, I'll actually meet you all tomorrow for New Year's Day. This is kind of a two-parter, so be right back. Alright, and welcome back to the second year in spring once again. Last year, we couldn't actually participate in this festival as we got here the day after. Or that day, or something like that. I think it was the day after. So now I'm going to waste a little bit of time, that way hopefully we've timed this up well, by just cutting down everything. Uh, I'll actually pick up these since I'm going to need them anyway. That did not take very long at all. I'm already done, there was almost nothing to do. Happy New Year, Kyle! I'm looking forward to reading your feature for another year. Happy New Year, Kyle! All the best to you in the New Year! Happy New Year, Kyle! It's a new year! Happy New Year, Jake. I don't care if it is a new year, I still don't want to get to know humans better. Race of home! Good morning, Kyle! Happy, ha happy New Year! It's another year. You don't have to make such a fuss about it. Ah, uh, but it's fun, Barrett. Happy New Year, Kyle. I'm gonna make so much money this year. <laughs> That's the spirit you way. I sure want to be as optimistic as you are. You have to start the new year with the right attitude. Come on, Kyle. How about being my first customer this year? Well, hurry up and buy something. <laughs> it looks like she's gonna be even more pushy this year. Happy New Year, Kyle. I hope next year's just as nice. Happy New Year, Kyle. Here's to the next one. Happy New Year! Work hard again this year, Kyle! Happy New Year! I wish you nothing but the best, Aaron. Aaron? Kyle. My name's Kyle. Who's Aaron? Weird. You're an excellent farmer who brings me nothing but transcendently delicious things to eat. Huh, that's weird. I wonder who Aaron is. Happy New Year. Another year of swords lies ahead, Kyle. Happy New Year, Kyle. Here's to another good year. Happy New Year, Kyle! This New Year... The New Year makes you just want to go and do something, doesn't it? I'm gonna make my resolutions. <laughs> the New Year really has gotten you excited, hasn't it, Julia? <laughs> First off, I want to make my skin a little nicer and improve my fashion sense. After that, I want to spend more time in the bath. I've got so much to do. Mm, seems like it's gonna be a really busy year, doesn't it? What with that and all. Happy New Year, Kyle! Hope we can spend more time together this year! Me too, Roy. Happy New Year, Kyle! Here's to another good year! Hooray! You're off to a Happy New Year, Cammy. Okay, Happy New Year! Happy New Year, Kyle! Oh! They're done! On the... New Year! Wild! We love to see it! So there are only two crops I need to currently water. These ones right here, and the emery flowers. Awesome. Happy New Year, Kyle. Have another healthy year. Happy New Year, kid. Hope you're ready for it. Happy New Year, Kyle! <laughs> and that's it for the year. And that is every holiday in Rune Factory 2 thus far. There will be a slight difference later, but we'll get into that. Guys, uh, we're done. We're done with every unique thing that we can do at this point in the game. And as such, it's time to transition. There's going to be a big difference between this part of the game and the next one. And we're not going to get quite into that yet, but know that it's going to require us to get married. So that's what we're going to do. I'm going to go, starting tomorrow, show off every single marriage event. Now, the reason that I didn't do this earlier, and, you know, just like doing it at the beginning of last month, is because... You actually can't go to festivals with your wife. At all. You wouldn't have been able to, like, let's say we married Alicia. Alicia would no longer be able to be spoken to at the New Year's festival. She would not be able to be taken on a date at the uh, Shooting Star one, danced with at the dancing contest, none of those. It is a huge oversight, and I'm not sure why they decided to do that, but 
uh, when it comes down to his scripting errors, they have to be in their spot to be spoken to, or at least on the screen for it. And um, they're not. They're in your house instead, because they didn't really think that one through. It's not great. So I waited. I waited and I waited. And now, starting tomorrow, we marry every single girl in order. And then we actually get married. And we progress on with the story. Uh, I'm going to call this one here. I'm not sure how long the episode's been. Uh, I've probably done like six to nine minutes or so just for these two days. And then, I don't know, what I had before. <laughs> probably half an hour to an hour. Hopefully. Maybe. Either way, I'll see you all next time. And I hope you all... Fin I'll see you all next time. And I hope you all have a fantastic day. Goodbye.